Farmers usually rely on advice of extension workers. They don't have the soil sampling capability for stage-specific insight. Ha! This year no joke. All my crops go grow well. I go make sure say fertilizer what I go buy will be the best. It will make sure my crops go grow but go well well. Ah, kilo shell. Ha! I don't believe I'm this one are the best fertilizer. I bet give me three bags of yara there. Based on this advice, the farmers apply nitrogen before the tearing and panicle initiation stages. A few weeks later, rice gets stressed because the large amount of nitrogen fertilizer they applied was sunk to groundwater, and then they start blaming witches and the extension worker for conniving with their home witches that despite pain they lose a lot. Hey, now wow. Everything don't scatter. Which can wala be this safe? My crops move in the ground up say I put fertilizer everywhere. What in the happen? Ah ah! Hey God, you be like say my village people don't find me come here. They don't find me come here. What in happen? No be fertilizer where I put come up all this crop. Nothing they grow. Ha ah! Ha I go alive. Which can wala be this? Sure, this village people where they winch me. They go here and today. They go here and today. I go finish them today. Which kind of wahala be this? Which, which, which nonsense be this? Wait in. I go work out there. They go finish today. They go pafuka for my hand. Which kind of wahala be that? All this could be avoided with proper management of soil nutrient and pH. Nitrogen fertilizer use efficiency in lowland rice may be maximized through a better timing of application to coincide with the stages of peak requirement of the crop and placement of end fertilizer in the soil. Proper phosphorus nutrition is critical for producing maximum rice grain yields. It is very important in the early vegetative growth stages and promotes strong early plant growth and development of a strong root system. Foliar feeding has proved to be the fastest way of curing nutrient deficiencies and boosting plant performances at specific physiological stages. Field research has established the critical concentrations of phosphorus, potassium, and zinc in the soil by correlating soil test values of these mineral nutrients and rice plant performance. Sampling soil is vital in giving insights that the average farmer will never know. Let's go to the field and show how we automatically do this. We have made this easy, continuous and attractive to the youth who are most energetic and can apply their high technical skills. Just log in to your account, create boundary of your field, select a grid size, and start marking the grid points. Our automated robotic arm connected with a tricycle will do all the work precisely. They go to each point, and collect the soil samples in QR coded bags. These bags help us work more efficiently as we don't have to write on them and this makes the whole process free from any kind of human error. Then we generate heat maps of the soil nutrient and pH profile. We post all the data to our cloud infrastructure so drone companies can access and use that to plan their flights to specific areas with deficiencies and apply to fix deficiencies. Hi, see as my crops, everything they find. God don't bless me with DGX. As I use DGX fertilizer, I can see say I pay only one third of money where they waste for that fertilizer. All my crops can't they find, find they shine, shine. You know, see as everything they ah ah, see as my crops they grow, but where where? Finally, I don't find the best. With DGX, you have the best.